Yo, what's up guys, it's Griffin, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make a custom brush preset. So, yeah, what we're going to do is, as you can see, we have our brushes here. Uh, so, yeah, what we're going to do is we're going to add another brush to this section that we can use for our designs. Um, so, sorry if I sound a little tired right now, it's 3 in the morning, and I just decided to get up and do a tutorial really quick. So, yeah, I decided to do something different and show you guys how to make a custom brush. So what I'm going to do is, I'm just going to look up something kind of random to make a brush for. I'm just going to look up Rock Climber. Because uh, the climber kind of stands out from the background. So, um, let's see, I'm going to use this one. I'm going to copy it. I'm going to paste it into our uh, canvas. And then now what we're going to do is we're going to use our rectangular marquee tool. And we're just gonna like, we're just gonna select the part that we wanna make our brush, like right there. That's how I want it. I'm gonna zoom in. Uh, and then what we're gonna do now is once you have that selected, we're gonna go to Image, Adjustments, and Curves. And now once you have that open, what you're gonna do is, uh, we're gonna be using these tools down here. So, using this tool, the one on the very right, we're gonna select the part that we want to we're gonna select the part that we want to be transparent so I'm gonna select the sky because I want the rock climber to be the brush so I'm gonna make the sky white by doing this oops control Z and then now that the sky is white we're gonna use this one on the very left the the black brush tool and we're gonna select the part that you want to show as the brush so I'm gonna select the rock climber until he's black uh, just mess around with it until he is all black. You can control Z if you mess up. Uh, I think that's good enough, so I'm gonna click OK. And then after you've clicked OK, you're gonna go to Edit, then you're gonna go to Define Brush Preset, and then I'm just gonna call it Rock Climber, and control D to deselect. And then I'm just going to delete this and make a new layer for our brush. And then as you can see, we have our new brush that I have made right here. Uh, so, yeah, now you can put the brush on your new layer. And, yeah, uh, you can do some pretty cool things with this for your designs, depending on what kind of brush you make and come up with. Uh, if you enjoyed today's tutorial, make sure to leave, leave a like and comment. And also, let me know what tutorials you guys would like to see in the future. And that's it. I'm out. Peace.